Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful So today's video is going to be my recommendations for if we have the $4.95 body care sale. So there is still speculation. We don't really know if it's going to be a thing, if it's going to be just tested in some certain stores in certain states, or if it's going to be worldwide, if it's going to be online or only in store, we don't know. But apparently this Saturday, there might be a huge, huge body care sale. So I wanted to get this video out for you guys and in general, it's kind of just like my fall so far uh, recommendations for what I like. So if you guys want to see what I recommend getting, then just keep watching. So I'm going to start off by saying what is kind of like the best deal because um, some of the products are more expensive than the others. And of course, if you can get them for less than $5 each, then it's a great deal. So the first one that I think is the best deal is the body butters now they don't really have a lot of body butters out right now but they do have some glotions in the sunflower scent and in the sunset glow and those are the glowing body butters and the body butters to me feel so good in the winter time um i don't really like any of the scents that they have out in the body butter but if you do i would definitely recommend getting that and then they have also the body mousse in strawberry pound cake and marshmallow pumpkin latte and that's like the whipped mousse that comes in a can that's also 1850 so those two are really really good deals that would be like a good thing to get for like a birthday present too coming up because those are just like novelty items um so those two are probably my top recommendations the third one would be to get a body scrub which is 1650 and they do have quite a few body scrubs that sound good to me. So one that I do have actually is the coffee and cream one. It smells exactly like coffee. It smells so good. I have not used it yet in the shower, but I just know that I'm gonna like it. And also it's a heavy exfoliator, so those are really good in my opinion. I like the medium and the heavy ones. And then they also have the strawberry pound cake body scrub. That's a good one. It's a whipped confetti. I love that formula. I'm probably not gonna pick it up because I don't need any more strawberry pound cake, but that's a good one. And then they also have the champagne apple and honey, and that's just like a staple fall scent. So I also wanna say, I'm probably not gonna pick up anything at the sale because I have way too much body care. I just did a huge haul if you didn't see that. Um, a few days ago, so I don't need to be buying any more body care. And I'm also really looking forward to a few things that Life Inside the Daily, pa Daily Page, wait, Life Inside the Page Daily Finds has posted. She's posted a few sneak peeks of a few things and um, they haven't come out yet. So when they come out, I'm definitely gonna pick those up. If they come out for the sale, then I'll probably pick them up, but I doubt that they will. They usually, Bath & Body Works usually does a sale and then they release new stuff like after the sale so you can pay full price for it. So I'm probably not gonna pick up anything at the sale. This is just my recommendations. So the next thing after the body scrubs are body sprays. Those are 1550. And then we have body creams, which are 1450. We have body lotions and body washes, which are $13.50, and some body washes are $12.50. So that's kind of like the price breakdown of what you're gonna get the most bang for your buck for. And obviously if you want a body lotion and it's only $13.50, just get it. You know, still it's under $5, which is uh, a third of the price that it usually is. So yeah, definitely, definitely get that. So I'm gonna tell you guys the fragrances that are out right now that I really enjoy. So the first one is gonna be Vanilla Mocha Cafe. I, I do find, however, that it is different smelling in the different formulas. I definitely think in the body, uh, the shower gel, it's a lot different and less floral than in the body spray. So the body spray does have a little bit of a floral note. I have had people tell me that it gives them headaches. So if you're prone to that, and I usually am, but this one didn't give that to me. Um, if you're prone to that, I would stay away from this. But if you like a kind of a coffee, vanilla coffee scent, then definitely go for this. Another one that I actually don't have because I used it last year is Champagne Apple and Honey. That is a great, great fall scent if you want something fresh and fruity. That one is so good. 
And then another one that is a staple fall scent is Sweater Weather and Bonfire Bash. Um, so I'm pretty new to both of these scents, but if these are your staples for fall, definitely pick them up because they will be on sale. And I know they come in body creams as well, so that'll be a good deal. I do have a Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin Body Cream from last year. This, to me, smells so much like fall. I definitely recommend picking up something in either Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin or Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. I don't like Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte personally. I don't like the marshmallow scents from Bath & Body Works, but if you like that and you like pumpkin scents, pick that up for the fall and you can just, you know, get that used up real quick, but you can get it for a good price. So I definitely recommend, I'm gonna smell it one more time. Um, one of the pumpkin scents just so you can have that feeling of fall and I would recommend in either a body lotion body cream or shower gel because Personally the sprays take me forever to use up and I know that I would only use it for like a few months during fall and never finish it So personally, I would not pick up a spray in one of the pumpkin scents The next thing that I have is actually sugared cherry crisp so I wore this for the first time the other day and the body cream is actually very unique because right when you put it on it smells like heavily like a baked pie like an apple pie and then um, maybe a couple hours later I was noticing that as I was getting into bed it smelled more perfumey um, and more musky so if you like either one of those things that I just described then you're gonna like this scent I have it in the body cream and in the spray now in the spray I noticed it is very very heavy on the perfume musk so if you don't like that like musky scent um, then you will not like this but some people say it smells like only like bakery but to me to my nose i get like heavy heavy musk so if you don't like that and i like musk a lot um if you don't like that then don't don't go for sugar cherry crisp but if that's something you're interested in definitely pick it up and then the last one that is actually from the new um, release line that hasn't come out yet is warm vanilla sugar this is a repackage obviously it's already out right now um, but I totally recommend picking up warm vanilla sugar or any of your like staple fragrances that are out all the time like gingham or whatever um, just because at you know less than five dollars smell one more time at less than five dollars that's a great deal to pick up you know your favorite things I might even pick up a champagne toast in any of those uh, formulas because I know I love champagne toast. So, you know, anything that you like that you've recently um, used up or gotten rid of and you miss it, pick that up because that's a great time to get it at a good, good sale. So that is basically everything. Oh, I wanted to mention, they also have moisturizing body washes in a few formulas and I've never tried those before so I think that would be interesting if you wanted to try like a new formula if you wanted to try the um, moisturizing body wash for the first time this would be a good time to pick one up when it's on sale and then if you don't like it you can always bring it back that is like one of the best things about Bath & Body Works is they have a good return policy um, so I recommend trying something new um, because if you get it on sale and you don't like it then you don't feel so bad you know you didn't pay full price for it but um, yeah so that is all of my recommendations for the upcoming body care sale if they have one if not then it was just my fall recommendations so far um, yeah I really hope they come out with those new scents soon because there's a pumpkin chai one that sounds amazing I love chai scents and um, pink velvet cupcake is coming back i'm very excited to smell that one so if you guys have anything you're looking forward to picking up at, either at this sale or when the new stuff comes out let me know down below i love to chat with you guys in the comments and thank you so so much for watching like comment and subscribe down below and i'll see you in my next video bye